Welcome back to the Domination Challenge with me, Warco. Hello everybody, we are here, we are back after the last episode. In this one, as you can see, I'm currently doing a bit of seeding. We could put the soybeans in here, um, just to get a bit of cash up. Should be able to make a decent amount um, of money. I did have to plough out this entire field. Um, I'm not sure why, to be honest with you, um, considering that, well, yeah, this it seemed to work a little to certain spots with this uh, cedar, because it is a direct drill, so it should have just go over the top of it, no problem, but there were certain bits that were still there, as if it wasn't part of the field, if that makes sense, so, I don't know. Configures not quite right. I don't, I don't know. I don't know. But, you know, either way. So, let's get moving. Now, I do have a bit of a plan. Um, over there, I am going to be putting in, um, in the other field. I am planning on putting in uh, wheat. So that way I can get some straw. Um, and I might need to use that for... Uh, the pigs anyway so it's part of the plan um i am thinking about putting down a silo as well because we haven't got one here um and we need to try and have a bit of well somewhere to put stuff you know don't really want to leave it laying around i think this is going to take a bit of time so i might just give you a little mini montage in a minute um, and get this seeding done and out of the way with. So that's done. We've got wheat in one field, soybeans in another. As you can see, fertilising is all good. I'm keeping an eye on these contracts. Uh, yeah. Field 10, 3,000. It's a little bit of money, but it's not going to be that much out of it, to be honest with you. I mean, the fields right here ain't really that big, so... It's not going to be major money, to be perfectly honest, so, yeah. Um, question is, what to do next? So, we have bales to sell. Just had to wait a little bit, and I did speed time up, because these bales... Well, they weren't quite silage at that point. Now they are. Um, so we're going to sell them off. Get a bit of money up. Got 113 grand. We could do better than that. Um, 
because we do need to get some equipment still um, and need to really progress onwards so I'm gonna sell these bales first I'll probably come back for another load to sell that off um, and then well not sure what to do from there I am thinking um, about getting another plot nearby to do a bit of logging because that usually does bring in some money we need to buy the logging um, well the forested areas anyway so it's part of the challenge might as well just get on with it. Right, let's go. Okay, so we're here now at the sell point, the farmer's market. And it should be round here. There. Okay. Let's get in try to do as much in cab as I can to be honest with you yeah one second there we go 32 grand Okay, I'm not going to complain that. <laughs> okay, so we've got more over there. So I think I'm going to go back and get another load. So, let's have a look at the prices here. 189 grand, we've got 145. Be good money. 130 for this. I mean, I, could, I can get loans if I want to. In fact, I may have to go down that route. Um... But as long as I pay off the loans, it's not really a problem. So I am thinking about expanding the empire, get more stuff going, get some more money. Well, the sheep need getting in, so I think maybe we can get on with the sheep as well. We've got grass bales to feed them, so... Decisions, decisions, decisions. When it comes to decisions, it can be difficult. Especially if you've got a few ideas ahead. Hmm. Right, we're back at the farm. Pull in. I really need to get the giant senator to get rid of that farmhouse at some point. Finding time is the problem. Yeah, uh, finding time. Okay, I'm just going to park this up here for the moment. And I will get some more bales put on here soon. Now, on the sheep, we'll get this, I think. We could do chickens as well. And we think we need to get hold of tanker so 7500 for that one liters 76 price 15600 for 18000 liters I'll try that I think I'll take that off cuz I don't need no plates not a realistic series so right let's get them Let's get the sheep. Right, so I thought I'd use the Leyland to collect the animals. It kind of looked like it sort of goes with it, really, didn't it? I quite like it. Bit of a Thomas the Tank vibe going on. But yes, I know it's a tractor, not a train. I get it. Right, so we are heading to the animal market. We're going to buy some sheep. Uh, I think I'm going to get an assorted lot. Um, I don't think it was... I don't think there was that many that need to go in there if that makes sense to get a full load. So it's probably good. It's going to take more than one load, obviously, because I think I can only get about 13 sheep in this thing. So, yeah. Might get this one, go away and get another one, and then just go away and get some more later. So, okay, sit rep. 
Um, yeah, I, I know it's been a while since I put a video out, uh, about a week or so. I'm trying my hardest to get more videos out there for you all to enjoy. Um, and I have got a new series that is coming out very, very soon called Shire Tales. Um, and it is, for all intents and purposes, it's a roleplay series. Um, and that is going to be coming out very soon. It's on Fulton Farms. Or at least it will be starting on Fulton Farms. Um, and it is based in the 1990s or late 1990s. So... And then it's going to progress. I'll probably do about two or three seasons of it um, before I go over to another map. If I go over to another map, um, maybe two seasons. I'm not sure. We'll see. We'll see. Um, I have there is a map that I have been waiting on, which I would really love to do a role play series on it. But um, that map. It might be worth just, um, I might just do a normal let's play on that map because it is it's a phenomenal map. I'm really looking forward to that map coming out. Um, needs no introduction either and you probably couldn't guess what one it is. Um, good old Oxy. Uh, right, let's get these lot back to the farm. And then we'll go from there. Like I said, I'll probably come back grab another one. If I do grab another load, it'll be off camera because, you know, there's only so many runs to and from that you're going to want to see, that people are going to want to see, and it's don't want to take it out with too much hot air, if that makes sense. Now coming to the farm. I know I've said this before, but this tractor just looks so nice on the inside. Old-fashioned British land, British workmanship at its finest. You know. Before it was, before it turned into, yeah, that'll do. It was brilliant, absolutely beautiful. I do like my old tractors. I don't know what it is, it's just, I, 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 don't get me wrong, I love the new ones, they're all brilliant, and I tell you what, the amount of gizmos and gadgets you get on a tractor these days is beyond imaginable. Um, but it's just the look, the sound. You just don't get that with a new tractor as opposed to an old classic tractor you know I mean I, I don't know I think I sound like a bit of a boring old fart when I say it but it's like vehicles in general I suppose old-fashioned vehicles they all had this um, personality you know we all knew, you all knew your vehicle, you know, you walk, you get into it, you kick the tyres, or you'll know how to turn a knob in a certain direction, and you knew it would start, you know, if it started. Um, you knew how to get it going. You know, it would have its moments. Now, it just feels like a machine, you know. A little bit of metal, no love, not as much love gone into it. But that's just me, I know. I'm an old fart. But, right. Let's get them in. As you can see, like I say, I've gone through a nice... Uh, nice variety. I'm going to do the same and carry on till this is filled out. I'm not going to do it all here um, in one go, but I will be doing it. I just prefer to have a variety to be honest with you. Right, let's get to work. Let's fill this tanker up. Um, what am I doing wrong? Oh, no, 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 no. It's diesel. What's it doing? There's the trigger there, look. I may have to move this. I'm making a right pig's ear of this. Come on. Come on. There we go, finally. Well, I reckon that's going to take a while, though. 
I do like these tankers, the LSFM pack. Uh, PC mods only, by the way, not not console. So I'm afraid. Because they are decent tankers. Right. Let's get you disconnected. Okay. Might as well get another load plumped on. Why is the money going down? Oh, the water. Uh, just looked at that. I thought, hang on a minute, my money's going down. Why? Filling up from the mains. It's quite an expensive tank of all. Oh, whoops. Come on. No. That's it. I did off camera um, straighten out the bales as you noticed because yeah they were just they were doing my nighting so right, let's get some uh, hay in there first of all and then I'll go and sell some more bales shortly I think I don't know, three, two, three. But just go two. Let's get him in. Oh, okay, four. Will I be able to transport them like this, though? Or will this go horribly wrong? Uh, you be the judge. Maybe if I just go slowly. No sun movements. I should get there. Okay. Should. Is that tank is still bloody filling? That tank is still filling. I should just looked at that water. Looks like there's water already in it. It's already. I oh, don't tell me that it's plumbed in. Oh, and dropped. And dropped. No, it's going wrong. Nope. 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 Don't do that. If it is plumbed in, it's good in a way, but. Means I've bought a tanker for no reason. It's not as if I need it for milk either. These are not cows. These are sheep. So I'd have bought that tanker for absolutely no reason. This come going on here everyone's probably disappeared and tuned north into somebody else by now there we go okay right, well that's the sheep sword leave that there that should be fine now I think for this episode I think I'm going to be drawing it to a close I'm quite conscious on the time of it so I hope you all enjoyed it. In the next episode, we're going to be getting on, doing a bit more. I'm going to try... I think I'm going to go get some more sheep as well in between. You know, I don't need another bale, really. So yeah, so I'm going to go get some more sheep, I think. I'll do this off camera this bit. Top them up. X, Y, Z. And I'll see you in the next episode.